today is what's today friday right today is friday hopefully you guys um have some wholesome plans oh my god not that a skip we do not promote drinking <laughs> but um today is friday so hopefully you guys you know be safe if you guys decide to club and do stuff that people in this world do on the weekends now we're gonna talk about Deshea Frost and this young lady with the green top name is Deja Deja was on one of his shows I believe now you guys know that Deshea does these shows he has multiple seasons I'm not sure which season Deja was on but this clip is from one of his recent streams and they appear to be cool but Deja went live and the caption says surviving Deshea Frost so she goes on live exposing Deshea now we're going to take a look at that but first we're going to get into this smasher pass famous youtubers slash tiktokers with Jasmine Marie and her friend so the first youtuber that they pulled up was dun 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 Deshay Deshay Frost <laughs> um Deshay I feel like Deshay not ugly like he's cute to me it's just like the, the height like I don't know I'm probably gonna pass yeah I'm gonna pass <laughs> yeah, this is the same thing. I'm a I'm a taller girl. Um and, and plus he got hella like he do. Yeah. You see that he do what what clip? <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. On street. What? Oh my god, you ain't see it? No. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to show me. Okay, but the shade we have emotion. The shade wow, for real. The shade we have emotion. But we yes. the shade we yeah, cool. You know you're the homeboy. <laughs> okay, so that was Deshay, and then next up is Jason Go, and then the last person that we're gonna do is Duke Dennis. Jason Go, I would smash. I feel like he's cute. Okay, and cool. I would probably smash. I think I would pass. Yeah. Is it like he too light skin? Um, you know how it, it's not about being light skin, it's, it's about whether you look like you act light skin. Mm. He looks like he acts light skin. Mm. So, <laughs> surviving the shape for us. All right, y'all, this is Deja. Remember, we seen her in the beginning of this video. No, so if, if his ego went the down, so he got this man ego that you kicked in the nuts by not giving him none. He's not used to being told no. Well, why to say this now? Because he got my page deleted. What the you mean he got all my pages deleted he's dming blog pages over me all no, why, say oh, this now? why say this now you were trying to be nice bro and not hold, trying on, to hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on my hold on my hold on my hold on my let me let me turn the comments off let me turn the comments off real quick i kept this shit in for what june july august september october november december trying november, to be nice february. eight months not trying to tarnish this man name like i even told this man plenty of times like bro i'm not gonna be the one to fuck you show up like i don't want to show up i'm not going to put nothing out like none of that like i'm gonna just be cool but once you like all right after the show a couple months go by and you still you talking shit about me people coming to me talking about you said deja this deja that deja this bro i was trying to be cool with you like i wasn't trying to beef with you i didn't want to argue with this man i didn't want nobody to know what he did to me none of that because at the end of the day you gonna get you gonna get what's like what's coming to you i'm a child of god you feel me so i always believe like bro you like you're not gonna be blessed that way. You're not gonna get blessed that way, bro. Like so, you wanna be putting your hands on females, calling them out their name, bitch, poor, all type of shit. Like that boosts his ego. He one of those type of niggas. Like he want his ego boosted type shit. You feel me? So a lot of y'all like, why are you just now coming out with this? I what tried to be cool that? with this man. I tried to be cool with this man. It's no way when I confront him about other people coming to me saying, oh you did this, you did you did that. The Shay said you said this, you did that, and I didn't do none of that because. Everybody know Deja minds her fucking business. Like, I don't mm -hmm. be with all that extra shit. But, mind your business, mom. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I don't be with all the extra shit. So, my whole thing is, when you're attacking me, you're attacking me, and you think, I'm not, I'm just sit, I'm gonna just sit there and just sit back and let you do what the fuck you want. No, y'all seen this nigga. Y'all seen what he did to me on that boat. Y'all saw it. Y'all saw him call me out my name, call me a bitch. Threw my $600 wig in a ocean. And a lot of y'all, and then look, look, look. People was in the comments 
People was in the comments like, why are you doing this to Deja? Like, Deja don't do nothing. She minds her business. Like, why you keep bothering Deja? He gonna put in the comments, I like Deja, so I'm mean to her. Shut the f*** up. You don't, you don't do no rude ass shit like to somebody because you like them. Shut the f*** up. Like, you just talking, bro. So, at the end of the day, I'm gonna turn the comments back on, y'all. But, um, at the end of the day, I was, I was like, I was minding my business. I was being cool. I was being nice. I didn't want to turn to nobody's name. I didn't want to put nothing on. But, y'all, he got my Instagram deleted. Next case is... Lumen DC tells Brooklyn how he feels about her. <laughs> You're the best besties in the world. Y'all think so? No, you all like a best friend. Not word. You like you like a sister to me. <laughs> <laughs> right. You like you like you like you know what you like. Let me be honest with you. You know what you really like for like don't take this the wrong way, but you like a little brother. No, 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 no. You like the girl. Like I need a girl like you. I need a girl that's like you, you know? Can you stop trolling? Nah, I'm, I'm for real. I need a girl that's like you. That's not you, but that's like you. No, you don't need a girl that's like me. Mm-hmm. I, I won't I'll let you know what I'm saying. Around my break. The clips are clipping today. All right, so this is the last case and then we're gonna i'll show y'all what jasmine marie said about duke guinness so this is jay cinco talks about his financial issues during his breakup with brooklyn frost around my breakup like around that time in atlanta bro When I first seen this clip, this is my second time watching it. When I first seen it, I thought after he sighed that he was like gonna cry. Cause I didn't see the full video. I just seen the clip on TikTok. And I'm like, oh, okay, he didn't cry. So people was in the comments pointing out how dramatic the sigh was. But if you think this is a young man and finances, when they are low, it's very stressful on any man so this is why the sigh because he probably felt you know like the emotions came back from when his money was low i probably had like seventeen hundred dollars bro and i know a lot of people are like bro you famous bro how did you not have no money you're like gang i had seventeen hundred dollars bro when when buddy bit that dog and I had to come out of pocket two thousand dollars. I probably was at four thousand at the time, and I'm I kind of like I, I probably had like six thousand before my breakup. I had like six thousand, but that just came with not touching all my money. That came with going on these expensive trips, you know what I'm saying? And then not touching all of my money, you know, due to the situation before. Um, that went with spent being the provider, paying rent, you know what I'm saying? Paying full rent on my own. Like, even when I was living with somebody, I was paying rent by myself. The, like, the only time I've ever split a rent was with my recent apartment. The recent apartment I lived in before this one. Because I was going low. I'm like, I can't keep doing this. Like, we're, we're our relationship is very unstable for me to just be paying all this rent by myself. You know, because it's like, I'm paying all this money. Then I just, if we just up and leave, you just up and leave. It's like, it's, it's on me. You know, so that's when I was like, you know, if this time we're moving in together, we're splitting this. But <clears throat> on some real shot, it was really like six thousand before the breakup. Um, <clears throat> probably like five thousand. Buddy bit the dog, and I was it, I was really like on my shit. Like I'm like, man, I'm finna, I'm finna. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do all these promos, do all this, do all that, do all this, bro, and get my money up. Then Buddy bit that dog. You know what I'm saying? Buddy bit the dog. Went from went from five thousand to four thousand that morning. That easy, five thousand to four thousand. Had to pay for the dog's little surgery. I was sad, but I had to do what was right. You know, I, I couldn't let that dog die at the end of the day. I had to be mindful for the for the, what I, the decision I've made as far as like but that's my dog. He did that, so I have to pay for that. Last case would be continuing from an earlier case. Jasmine Murray Duke. Duke who? Duke Dennis. <laughs> what are you, are you going to smash or pass? I would smash him, for sure. 
Because he's handsome. Mm. <laughs> he's handsome, but I would pass. Just because, yeah, I'm a pass. Um, w friend in the chat. 